In this short video today, I'm going to show you four cool insert mode commands that will supercharge your Vim editing workflow. Hi, my name is Marco. Let's get started. So here's the first one. So imagine you're deep down in this markdown file, typing a blog post about fuzzy finders. You're in insert mode and typing away. Maybe you don't want to have to look at the bottom all the time, but instead center the line where your cursor is on. A cool thing you can do in insert mode is hit Ctrl O to run one single normal mode command. In our case, we could use this to just center the line. Let me demonstrate. So in this special use case, we could just simply hit Ctrl O, ZZ to center the line. So now the line is centered and we can just go on typing here. So maybe type install via brew on the Mac OS or something like that. You can use, of course, any other normal world command. So one of my main use cases for Ctrl O is pasting something in. For that, just simply hit Ctrl O, P and you're done. Another cool feature in insert mode is word completion. Let's say I want to say something like for integration with another tool, blah, 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 but I don't want to type integration out myself. I can simply hit Ctrl N to get this completion menu. And we have some different suggestions here. These suggestions are based on other words in this file and I can navigate between them with Ctrl N and Ctrl P. To actually choose this entry, I can press Ctrl Y or I could have simply typed a space. So this is quite handy for longer words you know you have already typed in a buffer or that are already there. And this works out of the box. No plugins needed. What I recently learned is that you can indent lines right from within insert mode. So we restructured the installation section here a little bit and now we want to write something for Ubuntu. Let's say install via apt. And now we forgot to indent this line. You can simply press Ctrl T to increase indentation levels and Ctrl D decreases it. Also quite handy sometimes. Next up, pasting from a specific register right from within insert mode. So let's say I'm gonna delete this line here because this is total nonsense, right? And also I just wanna write a summary here. Before I deleted this line, I just yanked a line from up top because I wanted to put it in the summary. But now that I deleted this line and I'm here in insert mode, it is so great. I don't know what to do, whatever. Now I just want to put in the line I yanked before. The thing is, when you delete something in Vim, it gets put in the default register. So if I wanted to paste now, I could use Ctrl O P just as we said before. But now I would paste the total nonsense. Let's undo this with Ctrl O U. <laughs> so that we don't have to leave insert mode. There's a special register called zero that always keeps the last thing you yanked inside it. So it doesn't get overwritten if you delete something. So if I wanted to paste from the register zero now, I can do this with control R and simply press zero. Now I pasted just the line I actually wanted to paste. There are many registers and you could also paste from any other register right from within insert modes. This comes in quite handy sometimes. If you want to see seven more Vim tricks I wish I learned about sooner, check out this video. Thanks for watching, see you around and take care.